आर गोइंग टू डिस्कस अबाउट द लास्ट टॉपिक ऑफ योर ग्रेडियंट बिट इन द लास्ट सेशन वी हैव गिवन द इंट्रोडक्शन ऑफ पोजिशनल वेक्टर फॉर एनी पर्टिकुलर पॉइंट द पोजिशनल वेक्टर सिंपली डिनोटेड बाय आर बार सो बेस्ड ऑन दैट पर्टिकुलर इंफॉर्मेशन नाउ वी आर गोइंग टू प्रूव वन इंपॉर्टेंट स्टेटमेंट प्रूव दट डेल ऑफ एफ ऑफ आर equal to f dash of r by r into r bar remember r bar stands for positional vector r is nothing but it is modulus of r bar so based on that particular information we need to prove the given statement so in order to have an idea let us start with p of x comma y comma z this is nothing but it is a point in a plane three dimensional plane Corresponding to this, R bar simply it is denoted by x i plus y j plus z k. This is we call it as positional vector. And corresponding to this, you are going to define R, which is nothing but modulus of R bar. So directly I am writing here x square plus y square plus z square. And corresponding to this particular information. already we know that we have calculated as per in your last video session just you are calculating do r by do x value it is x by r do r by do y this is y by r do r by do z it is equal to z by r so by using this particular notation now we have to prove the given statement so i am just calculating the given value it is del of f of r so this is a function involving r as per the definition of del gradient definition i into do by do x of the given value f of r plus j do by do y of f of r plus k do by do z of f of r so just i am finding the derivative value i into derivative with respect to x for any function the derivative simply denoted by f dash of r into you just write down do r by do x value similarly plus j f dash of r multiplied by do r by do y similarly plus k into f dash of r it is do r by do z so just you are taking f dash of r it is throughout common and we are getting the value i into do r by do x we know that its value is x by r plus for the second one j into f dash of r already taken common it is y by r plus k into it is z by r so from this directly f dash of r Divided by r, it is common, and we are having x i plus y j plus z k. That is exactly your r bar value. So this is your given statement as per your given problem.